Yes, welcome back to another tutorial with me on ANSYS and in today's tutorial I am going to show you how to do a hole and a blend feature and, and uh, add a chamfer to the extruded part. So for this tutorial I am going to use the L shaped extrusion which I have earlier made I'll keep the link in the description down below so you can go through it and uh, follow that as well so let me open that first go for open locate the file yeah this one L shaped extrusion so this will open my file so what I need to do is just select geometry and uh, before that you save this file as you can do it later no issues so just go for geometry right, right click and go for edit geometry so this will again open the design modeler uh, where I'm going to like uh, add the hole and blend feature as well as the chamfer so mm, main motto of this video is to add a hole on this surface or uh, you can take any surface as you wish and add a blend feature over here on this edge and a chamfer over this edge so this is the main uh, basic thing which i'm going to do in this tutorial so let's begin with that so first go for faces select this one and select this once again so select this face and then go for new plane from here create and new plane so the plane is created on this face and next you select generate so the plane is created now so select your plane go for look at and then simply you can draw one circle from on this part for that i'm going to take the sketching and then draw a circle and draw a circle over here so then I'm going to go for dimensions and diameter first then I'll place a horizontal dimensions like this as well as a vertical dimension select this one and this one so now we just go over here details view and give the values for your diameter I'm taking 10 you can take any value for your it's up to you and this thing is 8 so once you are done with dimensions and all go for modeling and go for extrude and uh, next you go for apply and before applying mm, go for operations and select cut material and uh, extend type will be through all so this will create a full hole throughout the body so next go for ISO and click generate okay I did some mistakes over here control so my mistake I cut the whole thing over here so let me fix that for delete so 
then you go for extrude select your sketch and say apply go for cut material and the extent type will be through all so this will create a through all hole generate so now you can see the hole is created over here this is what i want to show you so next thing i'm going to add a blend feature over here so for that you can simply go for blend with fixed radius and select your edge this one and apply and say generate so your blend feature is done next I'm going to go for chamfer and select chamfer and select this edge and uh, the left length will be 2.5 Facility select geometry is so this one is the and this is also 2.5. You can take it 3 as well, no issues in that. So the jump for is generated. Just hide this. So here you go. This is how you do chamfer as well as blend and a whole feature in ANSYS geometry modeling so very easy be very easy and nothing complicated over here you can go through this very well so like my video and subscribe for more of these and yeah thank you so much peace